Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. So guys, today I am going to install Metabase in our local Windows system. It will be using a jar file which uh, Metabase provides. So we will first download our jar file from official website. Then we will try to install. Before before the installation, we have to have a uh, Java installed in our system. So first we will install Java and uh, then we will try to install our Metabase. Before going that, we will visit our uh, Metabase documentation. First, you can see here they have maintained uh, steps to install uh, our uh, metabase right so you can see here uh, there is a quick start uh, guide here so here we see download the jar file from metabase so i will click here okay so when we click officially it will directly redirect and uh, it will uh, download the official uh, metabase.jar file so it uh, like it is downloading now uh, till then we will uh, install the uh, java so you can see here to install java we have uh, I'm opening uh, a Java official website so you guys can uh, refer this here we have downloading the Java JDK installer I will click here so when we click here you can see uh, we have the options here we install the JDK from MSI right enterprise installer I will click here and you can see here I will click on the windows tab so here we have uh, into six installer right so we have to click on this so it will also download so Currently, I have the Java in um, in my system. So what I will do, uh, I will pause this. I already downloaded the Java file. So that's why I'm not downloading it now. So you can see here it is uh, downloaded. So what I will do, I will click on this and I will install. Okay. So you can see it will start now. Right. So when you click on this, it will ask for permission. Okay. So you, you click on the allow button and uh, later it will uh, give prompt like this. So it is just a simple you directly click next 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 and all. So I'll click on the next 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 and uh, let's wait for the progress. Yeah, you can see the progress is going now. Yeah, we just need to verify whether our Java is installed or not. So I will open CND. Right here I will type Java hyphen version. So I'll enter. Let's wait for the output. Yeah, you can see our Java is installed and our Java version is 24. Okay. So in this way we can uh, install the Java. And now you can see our uh, Aries. Yeah. So our Metabase is also downloaded. You can see Metabase.jar. It's a 4.52 MB and uh, its status is done. So you can see it is available in my download section. What I will do, I will create one folder for this as uh, Metabase officials also. Uh, suggest to create to store it in one different folder you can see i will go back to the default screen default page you can see create a new directory and move to the move the, the metabase jar into it okay so what we will do i will cut this one and i will go to the uh, c drive and i'll create new folder called new folder i will rename it to metabase okay here i will paste okay and now what we will do i have to open the cmd in this location so now i will open cmd okay yeah so it is open now now we will go to the official documentation here they have provided the command you can see java add opens java.base this is a command to start the metabase so i will copy this one and i will paste okay and enter so you guys can see now it will produce some output okay so let's wait for some more output and it will ask for a uh, uh, permission so till then we will check what the next process so you can see metabase logs will it uh, metabase will log its progress and uh, in the terminal as it starts up wait until you see metabase initialization complete and visit this one okay so i will copy this and i will open new tab and i will enter so you can see currently it is configuring okay and it is installing so here we can see how our animation is going on right so and we can see this logs also generating right so let's wait for uh, yeah you can see welcome to metabase uh, so let's get started now so i will choose my preferred language here okay my name is pankaj chowle as you all know and i will i will enter my default uh, like i will enter my uh, dummy email id here okay and the password uh, company and student okay and uh, company okay 
and password okay i will keep some oh there is a criteria okay okay so now okay now click on next and uh, here you have to uh, choose for what purpose you are using so i'm not sure okay next next so it is suggesting us to connect some servers like uh, database servers and all so currently i'm not going to connect any one of it so i'll do later and uh, here you say data preferences and all i'll click finish directly so here you can see you are all set up so now i will click to the take me to the metabase okay so you guys can see now uh, there are some uh, options available at the left side home how to use metabase our analytics yes right so if i click our analytics you can see there is a by default examples are there you can see these all right so congratulations so we have installed metabase successfully and in upcoming sessions we will cover all the uh, the topics like how to how to create charts how to create dashboards and all so if you guys uh, are interested please do like share and subscribe for more content like this okay bye bye